it's not just one person. Um, I talk to my children. I talk to my sister in the States. I talk to uh, my friends in Manchester, some friends abroad. I even talk to some people I meet at church, maybe my neighbor. So each, each stress or strain has got somebody I can talk to. So it isn't like there's one person that I, I can, you know, offload all my stresses and uh, strains to one person. It's all according to what it is, and then I've got somebody I can talk to. I don't talk to people in my area to find out what they're going through, but most of them is to do with the, you know, the prices of things going up. It's not just gas but it's the food, and the groceries, it seems every, every week you are paying more than what you paid two weeks ago. So I think that's what they are talking about, you know, for those stress. And of course, getting old as well is part of it, because you're always complaining of eggs and pens and things like that. And also sometimes they talk about treatment they got from their GP and things like that. My local church, which is not far from my house, they, there are always activities going on there apart from the church services. And there's also the, you know, like um, to do with health training, to do with um, young people coming to do um, like Taekwondo. Um, there's a church group that comes there on a Saturday afternoon. It's a club for South Asian people. And not far from there, the church run things like uh, uh, Zumba. There are a lot of things, even the uh, swimming, you know, there is swimming around the corner. There's adult education. There are all those things. But again, those things require money because you, there's nothing that is now you have to cough up a bit of money.